What's going on everybody? So by this point you should have already seen the Madden 18 trailer and you see a guy looking at Lucas Oil Stadium and it kind of gives you that feeling that the story mode is going to be possible. Um, I've been trying to reach out to several people to figure out what exactly they're doing because you got to remember the ultimate team you got you know connected franchise mode There's so many things within the Madden game that I don't really know how they can actually unless they take away the gauntlet. Keep in mind with the same Frostbite engine, that's what FIFA was able to do with like the journey scene and all that kind of stuff like that to kind of give you like a short span of what's going on. But if you really think about it, they could probably just add this mode to what, you know, to the franchise. If you Because you can actually have a star player and they can just actually put more things into that aspect of franchise. So it's actually already there if you really think about it. But... I think it's more of the hype situation because new engine, better graphics, it wants to be more realistic in the, the approach. I think it's kind of similar to how 2K is with my career because as we go on to the, you know, as gaming continues to evolve, people want to be more intimate with their characters. You know what I'm saying? They want to create players, they want to see things like, you know, NBA 2K, you're getting texts from, you know, real live NBA players, all kind of stupidness like that. Um, that actually adds a little bit more excitement. So as far as the actual mode goes, I know that there's a lot to be said about what they're doing to change up Ultimate Team. Now you gotta remember, Ultimate Team is the ultimate cash cow for EA when it comes to Madden. So in my opinion, the focus will probably be more on Ultimate Team. And if you guys are new to the channel and you don't understand what Ultimate Team is, check out any of the playlists that are here. I actually go through a lot of ways to help you get coins and things like that, just to help you get your game up. A lot of people have been leaving me messages, which is really, really cool. You know, I get hate mail and I get a lot of good mail, but a lot of the guys that are new from different countries and stuff like that, that didn't understand what Madden Ultimate Team was, that's pretty much what the gist of Madden is going to be for the, you know, for the near future. Creating, um, you know, your NFL team from, you know, NFL stars from the past and the present. And it has to do with a lot of coins and, you know, playing a lot of solos if you want to grind it out that way. But this is what I'm talking about as far as FIFA goes. Obviously, if you've played FIFA, you know about the journey and things like that. You're able to take players through uh, different formats within the game and, you know, your player revolves and, et cetera, you know, et cetera, et cetera. All that other stuff like that. But with Madden over the years, with the franchise mode, it's actually gotten a lot better with the things that they've allowed you to do. Um, obviously, they put in stuff with the uh, ownership and, you know, you could really get intricate like that if you wanted to do it. But I think that this story mode is going to be pretty much something within that realm because it, it's just too much in one game because I don't know, would you take away the gauntlet? Um, you know, because that's a way that a lot of people were able to get like those Gatorade packs with contracts for month. If you guys don't understand what that is, um, I can put out another video explaining it, but with the gauntlet mode, you take on different challenges and some of those things help you to get cards, you know, unlock it in Ultimate Team. And uh, if you don't do it, obviously if you want to go ahead and grind out solos within Ultimate Team, you can do it that way as well. But the, you know, looking at the format and what they're doing, I just think that they're trying to draw people in more to what Madden 18 is going to be. It's going to be very exciting just because of the simple fact that you're moving from an engine that a lot of people believe kind of took away from the experience of what Madden was. Um, of course, you're looking for a lot more realism. I played the demo of FIFA. I didn't purchase the game. So I can tell you from the demo itself, the Frostbite engine graphically and the way that they look is leaps and bounds better than the engine that Madden 17 was on. So I do expect a little bit more from Madden 18 as we get closer to it. I just don't know if the story mode is going to be something that's going to draw a lot of people into it. And I don't know how long it will be. You know what I'm saying? Like, just think about it. Right now, you could actually go through as a player in franchise and just have everything based around that player. So if, if EA uh, was developing a new story mode, more than likely, it would be within the franchise mode. You know what I'm saying? It wouldn't be something else because, like I told you before, it's just so much emphasis being put on Madden Ultimate Team. So with that, unless they create something else, because remember, Mad Madden Ultimate Team, that's draft champion, salary cap, all of that is the same thing. So those th that's already enough, and that's pretty much where a lot of the competition was made this year where they had a million dollars in prizes was through that so this might just be something to get you going like when you turn the game on you might have to pick a team and then that team they'll just put the stadium or whatever you're looking to you know what i'm saying like how they will transition it like if you like the giants it'll be the giant stadium or something like that and it'll just get you into the game uh previous maddens they made it uh they did like super bowl predictions and they made you uh you know utilize some of the characteristics of the new game and see what you're going to be getting yourself into um that's pretty much what it is i don't think it's going to be a full-on fledged story mode 
I just think it's going to be something to draw you into the game and to get people going because as much as EA Sports has their dedicated fans, you have to always be looking to get broader. So people have been asking for it. Uh, obviously, people on FIFA got it. And it's been like a competition back and forth, you know, with the, you know, the FUT, which is, um, you know, FIFA Ultimate Team, and MUT, which is Madden Ultimate Team. So it's like a back and forth thing where everybody is trying to draw from EA whatever they can. And a lot of people spend hours doing things, developing their personalized characters, stuff like that. So I can see it being something like that along those lines. If you're looking for a full though, I don't know because they're not really charging that much more for the game. Even if you get the gold edition, it's still a lot less than what the NBA 2K edition that, you know, the special edition with Shaq is going to be. So I don't see how they're going to put that much into it when it's already a lot of things within the game itself. You know what I'm saying? Like you're getting so many games in one, there's so many different modes. Um, I don't see them being able to put all of that into Madden 18 so quickly and just have a, you know, a great turnaround with it. So. In conclusion, I think it's going to be something that's part of the franchise mode. Uh, quote me on that. And then when the game is released, let me know if I was right on point. Come back to the video. Let me know what's good. Don't forget to subscribe to my new channel for Podcast Daily. Information in the description. I'll see you guys and girls next time. One love.